One. New Shepherd's first journey manned with Taurus will last 11 minutes, hitting a speed of 3,700 kilometers per hour. The capsule will separate from its booster. When it reaches outer space, the passengers will unbuckle and enjoy weightlessness all the way to 106 kilometers above the surface of the Earth. We've been training. This vehicle is ready. This crew is ready. This team is amazing. Uh, we just feel really good about it. Flying next to Jeff Bezos, founder of New Origin and world's richest man, his brother Mark, and the world's youngest and oldest space travelers. Wally Funk, 82, is a historic figure of the U.S. space program. An aviator for more than 60 years, she fought in the early space era to have women accepted into the space program. She excelled in the Mercury 13 project, but was never allowed to fly into space due to sexism. I love being here. This is the greatest team that I could ever be with, and it's going to go, it's going to happen. I've waited a long time, but I've dreamt a long time yeah. to get to go up. The auction for a ticket on the flight, meant to be the first space mission that's solely for tourism, reached $28 million. But on July 11th, Richard Branson's Virgin Galactic beat Blue Origin when it unexpectedly moved its own space flight early. New Shepard is expected to fly higher than its rival, beyond the 100-kilometer Karman line, the unofficial edge of space. Both billionaires insist that this is not a race.